Hello dear students. See, in the last class, so we were studying about the understanding diversity, understanding the diversity. As I told in the first class, the diversity itself means that difference. Diversity itself means that difference. So, but in the society we can see many kinds of a differences, many kinds of a differences. For that we learned or we read the story of Samir Ek and Samir Do. So, in that story we found three kinds of a differences. One is school. So, that one is going to school and Samir Do is not going to school because of economical situation. Because one Samir Ek had a money, Samir Do don't have money. So, that's why he was selling the newspaper. And languages. He knew different languages, Samir Ek and Samir Do knew different language and Samir Ek belonging to Hindu religion, Samir Do belonging to Muslim religion. So there we saw the differences. So in that difference going to school is it right? So that is because of a money issue because Samir Ek family had a money so they were sending Samir Ek to the school but Samir Do family don't have the money so that's why her mother also encouraged him to work. So that is inequality. So inequality means so not giving the opportunity. Inequality means what? Not giving the opportunity. So you in India everybody should get the equal opportunity. Equal opportunity. He is not getting the equal opportunity because of financial issue or because of financial problem. So whatever the problems that occurs because of the finance, because of the finance or because of the money. So that difference is called inequality. That difference is called inequality. See, uh, I can go to the school because I have a money, but my friend or my neighbor child don't have the money, he can't go to the school. Why? Because he don't have the money. So equal, the both have to get the education. So that difference is inequality. And diversity. So diversity means various cultural background. Diversity, diversity means what? Various cultural background so cultural background so cultural background so the word cultural you have to know the meaning of culture so culture means our life culture means what our life so what kind of dresses i do what kind of what kind of a language i speak what kind of a religion i follow so what kind of a region i am living so that are all comes under the cultural background so for easy understanding i Take you one example. I speak Kannada. Neighbor state people speaks Tamil. Tamil. That's why there is a cultural difference. Their life is different, and our lifestyle is different. So this kind of a difference is called what? Cultural differences. So that is what we learned in the previous class. Okay, now. So diversity means differences, but one kind of difference is called inequality. Another kind of difference is called diversity. Another kind of difference is called what? Diversity. So in this class we have to understand how this diversity evolved. How this diversity evolved or how this diversity came up or how this diversity can be understood. See now here I wrote some cloudy pictures. Cloudy pictures is just imagine these are the people. So here the group of people are living. Here one group of people are living. Here another group of people are leaving. You know that the people are using aeroplane, train, bus and more vehicles to move from one area to another area. So this movement of the people started less than 200 years ago. Less than 200 years ago, the man invented aeroplane, ship and train. So then the people started to move. I told the people started to move from one area to another area. For example, just imagine so this is Asia, this is Europe, and this is America continent. So that Asia people moved to sorry, Europe continent, and this Europe and Asia people moved to America. So their their culture is different. Here the culture is different, and here the culture is different. So when these three people are gathered in a single place, so what will happen? So for example, so they started to 
mingle each other. They started to mingle each other. So there will be a exchange of the language. There will be a exchange of the culture. There will be a exchange of the dress style, and there will be a total exchange of the lifestyle. Total exchange of the lifestyle. So when this started to mix, so then the new religion began. The new religion began. Did you understand now? So when the people gathered, the various part of the world people gathered in a single place or when they moved to one area to another area so at that time at that time so what happened they exchanged they exchanged their life their way of life and their lifestyle so because of this intermixing because of that intermixing the new culture emerged the new culture emerged so due to that new culture we can see the diversity we can see the diversity for example you know that uh, you all know drawing is it right while you are drawing so you can make a new color out of a two basic color is it right for example so black and red so if you uh, paint the same place the both color so you can make a new color so that is how the diversity emerged. That is how the new culture emerged. So I told that the people moved. The people moved. You may ask one question. Why said people moved? So they can live in their life only now. Yeah, there are reasons. There are reasons for the movement of the people. So certain reasons are famines. Famines means it may be drought. Famines means it may be drought. Due to the very less rain or Itself, some regions get very less rain. You know that in North Karnataka, North Karnataka, so there is a very less rain. So there, the people suffer, the people struggle, the people fight to get a water. So in those regions, the drought is a common. So they don't get anything to eat. So at the time, what the people will do? So they will move from that area to another area. So where they is a availability of the food crops so that is the one reason another reason is better place another reason is better place so why sometimes where we are living is not suitable for us is not suitable for us so for example so in the village people for example village people so there they will be living uh, but they don't get the suitable accommodations or suitable uh, food items are suitable work or suitable situation or suitable atmosphere climate whatever it may be so what they will do they will move from one area to another area where they feel it is okay it is suitable for us next piece i told that so in the 20th century that means after the 1901 until the 1950 so the world involved the world was boiling in the heat of the war in the heat of the war to protect or to save their life the people started to move from the area where there was there was a war to the other area where there is or where there was no war so when the people moved i told that so intermixing so after the intermixing so the new religion or new culture came up so that uh, various culture is called what diversity so not only the movement is the reason not only the movement is the reason for the uh, coming up of a diversity but also the historical reasons and geographical reasons what is that why is the movement of the people History means the king, the kings were living, the kings were living. I take you the example of Constantinople. I take you the example of Constantinople. Uh, that is a city 
in the asia in the asia so while the city was firstly so when the city emerged that time the city was called as a byzantium what byzantium so there is a influence of jewish jew people or yahudis so those people were living so after that uh, what happened the christianity emerged the christianity ruler the ruler who belonging to christian religion they started to occupy they occupied the rule or they attack or they took the that byzantium city under their control so the ruler is a christian and what will happen every the followers are the ruler itself what he will do so he will construct a beautiful church on the constantinople city so then what will happen the christian will come and they will start to live in a single place so first jew people yahudi people next christian people so after that ottoman turks came they also the powerful kingdom of the world so they occupied that area so now that city is called as a istanbul what istanbul i will make you show that whether it is istanbul or not um, so now what muslim came and they occupied that area so now again the muslim rulers so now not now at the times of olden days so they started to build a mosques so when they built a mosque the muslim people also went there and they started to leave see who are all living there muslim christianity and the original religion so that is jew people so now what happened so people while they are living together or in a single place so they influences each other so they influences each other some good things in the jew will be attracted to the christians and some good things in the christians will be attracted to the jew people so that's why again they will mix up so when they mix up means it is again for the birth to the new culture or new way of the life so that is how or this is the another reason how the diversity takes birth so another reason is geographical so geographical means you know that i told uh, in some area there will be a heavy light for example shomaka agumbe and uh, sagra chikmagaluru asan kodagu those districts gets very heavy light fall so their lifestyle is different so they will adapt their life according to the area where they are where they are living i told you yesterday one example that coastal region people so their culture is different so there is no heavy light and they have to depend upon the ocean or depend upon the sea for their life so that's why those people are very good in riding the boat or sailing the boat but malnadu people they are not good in sailing the boat so they are good in uh, going along in the forest or climbing the tree or growing the trees or growing the plants so are living alone in the uh, forest so the, they are good in that but in the uh, coastal regions they can sail the boat so this is how uh, that what i am trying to say is so this geographical reason also uh, one thing that for the emergence of the diversity for the emergence of the diversity that can be understood through the example through the example i will say so that in the next class